Charlies. This is Shah from Charlie's Angel Tarot and this is your reading for the 20th to the 27th. And we're going in on the 21st we're going in to Taurus. So um, we're going into a new time frame uh, of the Zodiac and so there will be changes especially around the 20th, 21st and the 22nd. Some of you might be more emotional um, if you are highly sensitive. That is if you are, have also more so if you have a water sign in your chart like the moon sign or your rising sign. And welcome to the new people and my cyber angels. Those are my faithful supporters and I appreciate you coming back and supporting the channel. Without you it is not what it is. And without the cards, me and you together, t together we stand strong, we make it lovely and homely and comfy. And for the new, new, one, new viewers, welcome, and if you would like to become a Cyber Angel, then please join us in the life. I'm using the Archangel Power Tarot deck, and on top of that I've got the Lenaman. I'm using also the Romance of the Angels Oracle and the Answers of the uh, Angels uh, by Diana uh, Virtue and um, I'm also using the color cards from Ina Seagull and here we go um, this these are Monday Wednesday th Friday and Saturday and Sunday and underneath is the all over energy for the week so please subscribe if you're new and hit that bell also on all then you'll be notified when I go live or when new videos are loaded up and I go live for free cards on Monday, Wednesday and Friday and I also do super chats and super stickers so if you've got a personal question please use those and I will give you a reading there's also other readings on offer but the, you can find the information below this video and that will take you also to the website and the little white circle on the right hand side the, with the little I. Okay, so let's get started. For Monday um, the 20th you have the 10 of Michael and Michael is with you on Monday. He will guide you into the new beginning as 10 is an ending and a 10 will become a 1 in the numerology aspect and num you might feel that somebody has been uh, stabbed you in the back uh, because usually this card is depicted with the Ten of Swords, with somebody lying down with swords in his back. There is a new beginning. She's saying, taking a bow and saying goodbye to the old, and she's ready for the new beginning. There's better things ahead of you. A situation has ended and you are finally free. New opportunities for happiness will now follow. Put the past behind you. Take the wisdom and your life experience with you and put it to good use. Use your wisdom wisely. Because you uh, might have, somebody might have done you wrong, uh, you might uh, uh, you might start self-isolating as you have the house. And that is not good at all, my darlings, because you have to get out of your comfort zone. Uh, the house does uh, mean protection and safety and um, so you know you might have locked yourself away don't don't lock yourself away I know we are in lockdown but you can also get into contact with the outside world with cyber Facebook YouTube um, Skype messenger phone some of your friends now you have the time so phone those real friends up I'm going to put the cards like that because um, there's not enough room on the table. You can see all my cards that I'm using. Okay, one day I will have a beautiful big desk. I have got a big desk, but it's, I can't work at it because the lightning lighting is bad. On Wednesday, you have the Knight of Ariel, and that's the Knight of Pentacles. The Knight of Pentacles is also represents Capricorn. Uh, so you could be meeting a Capricorn, but don't exclude the other air si uh, water, uh, earth signs. That is Virgo and Taurus. Uh, somebody will bring you news. This news will be 
uh, to do with material stuff like a house or a job or perhaps a baby or a birth or a new house uh, or an agreement investment is coming through and you're getting good news on that and it could also mean that you might be meeting a new person you might have st you might have taken the advice and not uh, isolating yourself coming out of your comfort zone and you might be starting uh, cyber dating or online dating and you you might meet a Virgo Capricorn or a Taurus but the knight is prominently uh, an, a Capricorn the the um, clarification card is the ring so you might be forming a friendship a partnership in business or in love so that is good news well you know take it easy online you don't know what be careful you don't go from the one extreme to the next extreme don't believe everything anybody tells you on Friday you have the two of Ariel and the two of Ariel means trying to keep balance it's the coins Ariel Archangel Ariel is the pentacle Ariel uh, sorry is the pentacle angel uh, in this deck and you're trying to balance time you're trying to balance your heart and soul your heart and mind all your work and home life perhaps you have to work from home and then you have to it's more difficult to work from home in most cases especially when you've got small children because you have to keep the children uh, entertained and busy and an eye on them otherwise they might be drawing or painting your doors or walls I know I've been there I've had small children as well and it says on the card it's important to have balance working multiple jobs or projects at all at once making work fun yes you can make work fun with the kids I know kids are work but they can be fun the clarification ca uh, clarification card is the boat you might be making plans to go on holiday but your boat of abundance is coming in and when you go on holiday you might be crossing water but abundance is coming in definitely because you've got all pentacles all aerial so it's got to do with money work finances and wow you started off with the knight of aerial then the two of aerial and now you've got the ten of aerial happy families this means a ten of pentacles so you might be getting an inheritance you might have won the lottery you might have or, uh, some uh, you might have been given uh, a, a gift of money especially if you have elderly parents and they are moving in with you that could be happening as well you started off with the ten of Michael look at that somebody stabbed you in the back <coughs> and that's an end so uh, and you might be getting meeting somebody so you might be moving in with somebody and you might be buying a house perhaps that is the news uh, that you are receiving that you are buying a house um, because you're extending the family because the ten of Ariel means um, the family card happy happy families take time out to enjoy yourself you can see the children play usually there's also a rainbow on those decks but not in this one but it means happy family um, if there is an inheritance then my condolences especially in this time you might have lost somebody my heart goes out to you and my prayers are with you and also my healing sessions so set the intention to receive healing like I said you might have elderly parents so somebody might come in to live with you because the 10 does mean expansion it could also be a pregnancy that could be the news the official news <coughs> by the GP G giving you a phone call or an email saying that you're pregnant and look at this 
luck is on your side and you'll be getting a gift so I think this is more of a gift for you a gift of money and luck so that you can buy that house to have a beautiful big family or expand the family with a granny in the house or a grandpa or a new arrival then you have the page of Raphael and the page of Raphael the page of Raphael um, is the page of cups and the page of cups represents Pisces okay the page of cups represents Pisces but don't exclude cancer or Scorpio the page will bring you love this could be of news uh, nurturing caring passion because that's what the cups stand for so in in if it is nurturing it could be nurturing your baby a new emotional situation messages regarding relationships or social invitations boom the family you might be planning to go on holiday and meet the family or go together on holiday great intuitive insights so you might be very spiritual at the moment because Pisces is the most spiritual of the whole lot and this is during the whole week okay and you've got at the bottom of the deck from the Lenemon you've got the clover Wow and look again letters underneath the clover so news is very imperative and important it's standing out like a sore thumb and underneath the page of Raphael you've got the tower change your life there is going to be big changes Aries bigger than you uh, expected and perhaps unexpected make the effort great love is worth taking the steps you are guided to take again you see young children here and I don't know but I'm getting a feeling you are delving into the past when you were a child or like I said perhaps there is a new arrival 33 you've got an angel number is the first angel number that has come out of uh, the deck uh, I'm, I've done already three readings and 33 is an angel number a double number again luck and it is aqua water and it's aquamarine color so you can uh, drink water you can wear aquamarine you can meditate on um, the color you can go swimming in a swimming pool if they're not closed down with the situation that we are in now and of course water means uh, it, you've got the cups as well where did you get the cups here you've got the cups so emotions and it says spirituality so there you go emotions your emotions might be very sensitive and high your intuition you might be exceptionally sensitive so listen to those red flags red flags don't have to be negative it can also be a warning okay it can be a warning of good or a warning of negativity but you definitely have news lots of news coming your way it is important that you remember this so let go of negativity and negative things in the past Aries stay within your strength have your emotions under control let your emotions go and 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 so that you can let go of the sadness and feel free when you need to be yourself I hope you have enjoyed this reading I am going live on Friday and Saturday or as long as it takes uh, for every zodiac sign and and there will be a discussion time and question time um, the times will be announced before so keep it in uh, keep it uh, keep an eye on it and um, I hope you will join with your suggestions or your questions after the discussion and the question time there will be time for you to ask your personal questions and I will be happy to give you a reading 
um, but this is only for re um, uh, questions that have done or people that have done a donation either prior to the uh, airing of the discussion uh, or during the um, uh, live session so I hope you've enjoyed this please share this video uh, for the 20th to the 27th with family and friends and become a member subscribe everybody and hit that bell on all and give us the thumbs up make this our channel and keep this channel like the you know this is the cyber family I love you I really do believe it or not take care be blessed and God bless and stay safe.